It's a wrap for Dayton's own Molly Brueggemann rowing in the women's eighth event this morning in Paris. Team USA finished fifth in their race. And back home in Dayton, fans attended an early morning watch party to cheer on Brueggemann in the medal event. Two News reporter Allison Gens was there and shares their reaction. Kramer's Tavern was packed with family, friends, former teammates, and fans of Molly all here to cheer her on across the finish line. All eyes glued to the TV inside Kramer's early Saturday morning. With a 10.50 a.m. start to Paris time, it was 4.50 a.m. back home in Dayton. But Molly Bruggeman's fans proved they were more than willing to wake up early. With this many people at the early hour, it just shows what a great community we have, what great support we have for the United States and for um, our local champion rower. The Dayton native and Chaminade Julian grad made her Olympic debut in the women's eight on Monday. Team USA moved on to Thursday's wild card round, placing first and securing them a spot in Saturday's final. Molly's brother Patrick says just making it this far is a win. To make it to the medal race is a dream of Molly's. It's all it has been. Um, it was really exciting to get together and just see her on live TV and represent our country. So, I mean, I couldn't be more happy for her. It was a nail biter of a race as Team USA contended for a spot on the podium. They raced well, they were right in there. And while Bruggeman and Team USA won't be bringing home a medal this time, she sets a golden example for aspiring athletes here at home. It's a message to people, men, women, young women, young men, all over the world, all over the country, that you, no matter what town you live in, you can, you know, fulfill a dream. And friends and family tell me that they will be there to cheer her on if she competes in L.A., maybe this time from the stands in Dayton. Allison Gens, 2 News.